Well, good morning, y'all. Um, it rained. Uh, I made a video earlier. Probably shouldn't have uh, deleted it. Uh, it didn't have any sound, at least I thought. But it probably did. But anyway, you know, God is good. I love when it rains because every time I ride in the rain, I walk in the rain, I get purified. Like, that's how God purifies the earth. Like, let it rain. And it's just such a beautiful, beautiful thing on how God's creation is just so magnificent. So magnificent. Now we have a little bit more light. Thank you, Jesus, for that light. Um, and I want to let everybody know, be thankful. Be grateful today. Be I don't care if it's snowing outside, sleeting, hailing outside, whatever it is. It's a beautiful day. Um, I'm not always this up, up and alive, uplifted, but today I am. By God's grace and mercy, I was actually supposed to go to work, and I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. I don't know. Maybe, maybe God's grace and mercy will let me go to work anyway. Um, but I, it's still a good day whether I get to work or not. Um, I could use the money. You know, I'm down to like, I'm, I'm just giving you a prime example. I, I, I want to be an honest Christian and let you know the suffering I, I go through sometimes. I'm down to almost like $4 could use the money. I didn't say I needed it. I didn't say I wanted it. I didn't say I needed it or wanted it. I could use it. <clears throat> but it don't matter. Because you know why? At the end of the day, I'm blessed and highly favored. Just like you are. You're highly blessed and favored as well. And God is good. God is amazing. Um, you know, I, I, I love reading the Word of God. Because there's nothing in the Word of God. Like when you truly read the Word of God, you, you, you find what's real and what's you know, what was fake. And there ain't nothing fake in the Bible. What I'm saying is there's fake things that's being taught in our lives. And, uh, and, and and we start to believe it, right? You know? And then when, when, when you actually read the Word of God, you see you start to see the truth. And and, and, and all those lies that, that was told to us, we can actually see it for a grain of salt. It was a lie. And, and, and we don't have to be defeated no more by those lies no more. And so I just want to give y'all that encouragement today because people are hurting. People are dying. You know, the Bible also commands us to go out and reach to other people. Um, and, uh, you know, I, love, I like to reach to the dope dealers and the gangsters because uh, they need salvation too. Um, I, I reach out to a lot of different people. Um, it, even yesterday, I got the witness to I can... I. I guarantee two murderers. And God knows what else other crime, crimes they are doing. Um, but God still loves them as people. Um, and everybody, everybody, you know, because I, I don't want people to think that murder is just a, a, a physical murder. The Bible says that if we hate our brother or our sister, then we already committed murder against somebody. And it goes a little bit further. Spiritually, if we hate anybody, we have already uh, produced murder in our own hearts. So each and every one of us are murderers. There's times when I get caught slipping too, and I end up hating somebody, and I have to repent of that. And um, so all of us are murderers in God's eyes. Because we all have hate somebody or even hated God at one time. And so I just want to give you all that uplifting message. Today, because God is too awesome not to tell somebody about uh, about Him, or to talk to about, about people. And look, nine out of ten times, people are going to hear the word of God. Nine out of ten times, you'll never get assaulted for Christ. I've been assaulted for Christ with a golf club. I've I've been almost tased for Christ, uh, and that's part of life. Uh, when you truly serve the Lord, you're probably going to get persecuted some way, shape, or form. Um, physically, uh, persecution is really not too much on the mental or the, uh, spiritual, uh, it, it's more or less the physical. Um, so not very many Christians get blessed to be persecuted like that. Um, so I, I just give God the glory. I'm going to keep on going, keep on trucking because God is awesome. God is awesome. So y'all have a blessed day. Bye-bye.